Hey there, true believers! Rain Kisaragi here with the Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Last time, we uh, did the Tail Cave, we saved a chain chomp named Bow Wow, and we can jump now. Hooray! So here we are in the Bottle Grotto. Let's continue on, shall we? Now, fully honest, uh, I don't remember a lot about the Bottle Grotto, or kind of this point forward in the game, which is hilariously sad since it's the second dungeon. But, uh, we will, we will figure it out to the best of our ability. Ah, uh, yes, the central puzzle to this place. Now things are done. Now things are down, now they're back up. Hooray. Alright. And there's shy guys in here, too, because, like I said, we're gonna see some weird shit in this game. Let's see what we can do down here before we... Okay. You can hit those around corners. There we go. Alright, a much better strategy for how to fight them. The second key. Very good, very good. More keys are always a better idea. Get some floating powder, then die. Uh, I don't know if we want to go down there. Oh yeah, these guys are actually pretty creative how, how they move. You see, they face the opposite direction we do. And their masks are invulnerable. <clears throat> but if we approach them back to back and do a sword spin, it doesn't matter where their masks are. I can't go back and get that right now. I mean, I can, but I have to actually go back and get it, which, you know. Much easier to go this way first. Let's see what we got in here. Yes, it's heavy, I know, Link. Thank you. Okay. And if we shove these into position... Hooray! Stairs! Behold the power of stairs. Um... Oh, please. Yep. Alright, what do we got over this? Okay, this isn't the one I thought it was going to be. We're good. Get some, some health. A little one-way door. Oh, hey, it's a boss. Or a mini-boss, rat. Ow. Perfect. Best plan ever. Yes, yes. And we have the warp back to the start of the, the, start of the dungeon. <clears throat> Hooray. Yes, it's heavy, I know. It's heavy, I know. Alright. We're done with that. Oh, hey, yeah, this room. So, by the way, this room. That's a, uh, that's a black hole. It's, I think, only in this room? In the entire game? But it sucks us in and tries to drop us into these pits, so it's not very nice. I don't need that. Oh my god. Yes, it's heavy, I know. Please. Okay, 20 rupees. Always appreciate 20 rupees. Come on. There you go. Alright, what do we got? Oh, hey, it's goat. It's booze from Mario. Why are there booze from Mario in here? And how do I... Oh, I fight them with the, with the light, of course. Okay. Glad, I'm glad we figured that out. Ah, it's a croissant! That's the power bracelet. I can pick up pots and stones. Hooray! So, we equip this level, this level one this level, this level one croissant, and all of a sudden, we can heft and throw things. It's wonderful. This is totally not a thing that's going to be used the rest of this dungeon. Uh, I could just brute force it that way. Okay, I'm going to have to. Whatever, we got a key anyway. Good enough. I should actually pop that down like that too, so I can... I should pop this up like this so that I can... Come on. Down, please. There you go. Now I can kill you, you fool! We have more enemies. Just 
whap that by accident, whap it right back. Ouch. Being savaged by these by these poles voices now. That's what those are called, by the way. They're poles voices. There we go. I was gonna say, I was pretty sure you had to throw things at them. Uh, back when the uh, when the Game Boy Color had a microphone, or no, it wasn't. It was on. I think, I think it was the Game Boy Color that had a microphone way back in the day. Um, you had to yell into that um, in the Japanese version only to to kill the pole's voice. So that's a bit of a fun trivia type thing for you. Enjoy that. Hearts? No, of course not. All because I didn't want to see the oh, it's heavy woof with your blah 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 blah. Whatever. Okay, so this is the room that I thought we were gonna in before. This guy, he's angry and won't lower if you just stand by yourself, so we have the pot, so now we can oh he does lower. Isn't that clever? I'll show you on the on the, on the way back. Oh alright, cool, the way back. So see, he doesn't lower because he's angry. But the pot helps us ch uh, calm him down and make him lower. Ah oh, good, this room of death again. This room of death and skipping again. Damn it. Alright, whatever. It happens. Alright, anyway, we can get this now. That's cool. Ah, good, money. I, I like money. It's 50 monies. I like 50 monies. Uh, let's see. Let, we should actually explore this way, shouldn't we? Oh, I don't have any keys. Ah, bitch. Alright, that's fine. There are keys I can get at that won't be too much of a problem. Well, key I can get at that won't be much of a problem. I think this room is optional. This room down here, I think that's optional. If I remember correctly, it's just a room that leads to a room that has a key in it. Oh, I have to kill you two again? Oh. I've never been more upset in my entire life. Not really, I've been far more upset than this. But, I have to do this again. Alright, so, but ciao. <clears throat> Wasn't that fun? And I'm one penny shy of getting the thing that I need to progress. Alright, if you say so, game. I appreciate your generosity and kindness. Key. Alright. Alright, time, time to ruin the dungeon based on curiosity to... Time to ruin the dungeon now based on curio <laughs> on curiosity. Yeah, this is just a room that teaches you, teaches you how to fight these guys. We, we should have done this room first. Oh, it's a compass. That's cool. Alright. Chest and nightmares are hidden. This comes feature. Cool. Alright, so we can... So we can uh, we can screw the dungeon up. Well, we're just gonna warp to the end, <laughs> or to the midpoint rather. Oh, I can go down there now. That's right. I can go down here now. Oh, it's heavy, and I can't lift my best. I yeah, know. I make the criminal mistake of uh, keeping my jump equipped almost all the time. When I up oh, uh, prana plants too, they're here. Cause you know what I want in my. All right, I feel like I should have been the one to get hit there, but all right. Oh, this room. I remember this room, but only a little bit. Uh. Shit. I need the stone nose to do this correctly. Um Uh let me, let me dip into my my pool of random knowledge to try and remember how to do this. I think it's the imprisoned pole's voice. Then the keys last this guy. <laughs> I remembered after all these years. 
It's been 20 years! Alright, cool. <laughs> could, could you believe I pulled that out of my ass from 20 years ago? So, uh, what, what I, the stone beak th situation. So one of the one of the one of the wall faces that use the stone beaks in this dungeon will tell you the order uh, to kill these enemies in this room correctly to get this chest. So I don't know how I remembered this after all these years, but hooray, I apparently did. So huzzah! <laughs> oh please, Paul's voice. If you didn't know what this rabbit was called, that hit doesn't help you at all. But uh, if you know it's a Paul's voice. Then it doesn't matter. Uh, I think I can just, I think I just jump through this one, right? No, I need the, I need the thing for this. Yeah. I, I remember. I'm taking this pot with me though, or not? All right, so we, we missed a few rooms in the dungeon, but that doesn't matter because we got to where we need to be. We have our we we have our, we have our power croissant, and it doesn't really matter. Also, I'm gonna have to clear my throat really quick. All right, I'm good. Oh God, it's Santa. Uh, oh no, it's even worse than Santa. As long as he has his bottle, we can't hurt him. Okay. Okay. Alright, it won't break the bottle. Well, if I smash into the wall. Ha <laughs> ha! I've found the strategy. As long as I have my bottle. Alright. Okay, do this again. Oh, dungeons that make you use the thing you got inside the dungeon to beat the boss. I how I how I miss these as a concept in Zelda. It's only been one game. We have, we haven't we haven't done this, but it just feels wrong to like not have this be the thing since it's it's always been the thing. All right, so I've destroyed his bottle. Let's get my feather back. I did. I destroyed your bottle. You shouldn't have said anything. So this is the boss fight now. We, we, we went from interesting puzzle to uh, just slap the clown G. Also, what is it with my let's plays and having there be having there be genies as bosses lately? Mm. Anyway, the magic conch. Victory screech. Hooray! We win. Prairie. The prairie is waiting. All right. I don't know where the prairie is. Thanks, thanks, Chomp. Actually, we don't have, we don't have, we don't have to go back through this. We, we don't we don't have to go back through here the regular way anymore. We can just uh, skip like this whole swamp because we don't have to do it anymore. Huzzah! Alright, is there something under this one? I don't remember. There is not. Okay. So, there are um, hidden grottos around the island, and I don't remember where all of them are, or where any of them are, as a matter of fact. So, um, we're just gonna wing it. But there's a way we can go here, so I'm gonna go ahead and go through here, because... I can't do anything in here. Alright. Alright, cool story, bro. Oh, I need to get, like, four more rubies. 
like three more rupees. I know you let them drop their drop their, their drop their drops, but could you please let me do something? I'm the hero of whatever island we're on right now, and I'd like to contribute. I need three rupees. Come on, man. How am I gonna get three rupees? Oh, I can try out. I can try out something that um that um Chiago said I should try. I. That's not what I wanted. I don't think so, but all right. Okay, enough of that. Let's let, let's go try chicken. Let's go try <laughs> um try this out. Trendy game. One plays ten rupees. Yep, sure. All right. Let's see if I figured out this timing correctly. Let's see. We go. Like, what is it, like, right here he said to do it? Oh, I hold the... Okay, you, uh, you, you, you I, I, I held the button for too long. That was, that was on me. What? I was so happy about having money and I just lost all of it. Let's see, it goes, like, right here. And then we just tap it right when it crosses the thing. Oh, I was too slow. Okay. But I get the idea. Okay. So now we need to farm for money because I have a gambling addiction, apparently. This is the screen to, this is the screen to farm in. Look at all this grass. Do we really need the sh- Yes, we, we, we do in- Oh, hey. A secret seashell. These are important. i probably not going to get all of them, but I can try. I'm also bad at things, so, you know, don't put stock into me getting all of them on that ground alone, really. Oh god. I need to make some cash because I wasted it all on gambling games. Just like, it's just like a loot boxes, I just waste all my, all my cash on loot boxes, now I can't go save the world. Oh, we'll get our 200 coins and we'll get coins. May as, well, may as well be coins. Get our 200 fun bucks and then we'll go buy a shovel. Wait, is this important? Yes, we, 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 we need the shovel. It's fairly important for several reasons. Oh, hey, sweetheart. It's my kitten. If you guys heard him, heard a little meow. That's that's her. That's her and her little meow. She was she was a bit away from the mic. You probably didn't hear her that time, but make sure I don't hit the chicken because that's that's always a bad time in Zelda. Bad, bad, bad time, bad time, bad time in this one too. So uh, let's not attack the chicken, shall we? Almost. Yeah, I'm sorry about this. I should have uh, played better at that mini game. Then I wouldn't have to do this on screen. There, perfect. I'll have one dollar you do to my name afterward. Perfect. Oh, hey, there they are. Bombs. Yeah, I wanted to uh, del a deluxe shovel. Okay. Cool. Alright. Okay, so we now have the shovel. What does the shovel do? The shovel. Hell yeah, we can dig holes now. Yeah. Sorry, chicken. D digging holes allows us to find find more stuff, like that extra heart. But that's about it right now. There's a few secret things that we can do now that we have the shovel, but uh, we'll we'll get to that later when we when we cross the uh, situation to do that. Oh, this guy is unique because he has wings, you see. So we can jump over our sword swipes. Like an asshole. 
Also, this screen is full of them. There's a monster in this screen. See? Look at them. You thought you were safe. Pfft. You're never safe. Not in Link's Awakening. Okay. Oh, hey, look, a wall for bombs. If only I had friggin' money and wasn't broke. Cool. Look, you. Honey, probably important. I can't pick this up. It's too heavy. Alright, so let's see, where the hell do we need to go? I don't rightfully rem- Oh, we're- okay, okay, we, we, we are in the prairie right now. This is good, this is good knowledge. Uh, I forgot where the prairie was, so the fact that we're already in the prairie is pretty, is pretty good. Ah, good. This. Ah, yes, the the uh, the uh, the butt plug cave, or the slime cave, whichever one applies. Okay. Okay. Oh, did you? Guess that's a fair reason to uh, be forced to flee. Okay. Golden leaf. Is it a physical golden leaf or is it just really thin gold? Sure. So, uh, you, you said leaf, friend. Remember, remember to buy a shovel. Well, it's a good thing we have one of those. Alright. If I remember correctly, there's something in his backyard. Hmm. Can, I get, can I get into his backyard from here? No. Yes. Alright, we will, we will explore Richard's backyard in the next video. Because there's a pit we're gonna fall in because I'm a cretin. Okay, we're not gonna explore Rich's backyard in the next video. But I hope you guys had fun, and I'll see you next time. Till then, till then, okay? Out.